Your site has tanked with the Google update and you're anxious to make a whole bunch of changes to the website. Here are the items I'm going to ask you not to work on while you wait for the update to end. If this was your site, I'm going to ask you not to make major changes to headings, meta titles, the actual content. You're not going to add a ton of content to your ranking pages. You're not going to remove a lot of content from your ranking pages. You're not going to redo all of your interlinking. You're not going to add a whole bunch of new interlinking. You're basically not going to make changes that will affect your keyword rankings. In the last video, I talked about the changes that you could make while you wait. If you missed that video, go check it out. But in this video, we're talking about what you shouldn't be doing while you wait to see if your website has been truly affected. Now, I understand you're under a lot of pressure and stress when your website tanks. Believe me, I totally get what this feels like. However, the reason why I'm asking you not to make a lot of changes is because sometimes you can be, have a site that's sensitive to the algo updates being rolled out, rolled back, even the trimmers, but your site may not truly be impacted by the Google Core. Here is an example. This particular site went was affected on May 31st through June 26th. That is 27 days of plummeted traffic, plummeted keyword rankings. No changes were made to the content or the site, and the site bounced back out of it to pre-core traffic. Now, think about if you had made a ton of changes to the actual content, headings, interlinking, and you were going to bounce out of it at the end once it was completely rolled out. But you may not know that if you've made a whole bunch of changes and you've made a whole bunch of changes that may harm your keyword rankings when all along you were never truly going to be affected for the long haul. So this is why I'm asking you to wait. Another reason I'm asking you to wait is the SERPs really fluctuate during times that updates are being rolled out or rolled back and so on. If you make changes right now, you cannot evaluate if those changes are good or bad if the SERPs are really turbulent. You're not going to get the true rankings of your changes. So spend your time making the other changes that I talked about in the last video and not making changes that will truly affect your keyword rankings until you know if your site's going to be negatively impacted. And as of right now, we don't know if your website is truly going to be negatively impacted for the long haul. I'm asking you to wait it out, even though you want to go in and change a million things. I totally understand and feel the pressure that you are under. And again, for those of you that want to join us in the SEO Algo Secrets group on Facebook, we'd love to have you in there. See you guys in the next video.